Hey guys, thank you for joining me. You might have seen a live on this earlier, but YouTube has been super crazy today and it has been deleted. So I'm not sure it's probably user error or something that I've done, but this is the third time I'm filming this, but that's how important it is for me for you guys to see these colors, how beautiful they are from Peachy Olive Glitter. I'm going to be showing you February's peachy palette. Now there's not going to be a peachy palette this month because it was Krista's birthday and they ran a super sale. So this was last month and this will give you an idea of what you'll get when you order a peachy palette. Now all of the colors are going to be different every month, but they're all the same in one box each month. So if you ordered in February, this is what you would have gotten. You would have gotten these three opals, which are absolutely beautiful. At first glance, when you see an opal, they might all look similar, but when you sprinkle them out on a little bit of paper, it gives you an idea of what they're going to look like on your cups. What's really neat about opal glitter is that it reflects the color underneath it. So even if you were to put Quinn on a different color base, on one on a pink base, and then put Quinn on like a blue base, it's going to pull different colors and reflect different colors. So I'm gonna sprinkle these out on some paper, show you guys how gorgeous these are, talk to you a little bit about peachy olive glitters, and hopefully answer any questions that you have. If you have any questions at all, please be sure to ask them in the comments and I'm happy to help. So this is Solstice and I love Solstice because of the sparkle and shine. Look how beautiful, sparkly, a little bit of a pink tint to it this one is. All that I have shown you guys, I do have my ring light on um, to give you a little bit more detail. Um, but that is seriously that sparkly. And what I like to do when I am unsure or if I have a new glitter is I like to put it on a piece of paper and shake it down just a bit. And it shows you the different sizes of the mix. So with Solstice, you're going to have these smaller pieces, you have some medium pieces, and then you have some large pieces. Every one of these colors that I'm showing you today are a chunky mix. So that one is Solstice. It is absolutely beautiful. The next one I'm going to move on to is Quinn. And I think that this one is my favorite um, because it does show a little bit of pink, a little bit of blue um, when you kind of swatch these colors out. And let me show you what I mean. So it's not color shifting, but when you do move it back and forth, you see different undertones of pink and different undertones of blue. It's got that beautiful shine to it, just like the one before it, but these are all different. Um, and once you put them on your cup, you're going to see. One of the favorite cups that I ever did was an opal on different color bases. I put them on different pastel bases. This one is Quinn. And it was so neat because it would look different on each base and it really just kind of blew my mind. So this next one is going to be Fillery. This one is gorgeous too. It has more of a blue tint to it to me, kind of a blue undertone, still just as sparkly and shiny and absolutely beautiful. But this one is unique as well. But I just cannot get over the shines and how beautiful they are. But you can see this one has more of a blue tint to it than the others did. Still absolutely beautiful. And you can see like as I shake it through the paper, um, the different sizes in the mix. So that's really why I like to do that. Um, so I'm going to move on. These next two colors as of today, these are not in stock. They did sell out. What I like about Peachy Olive Glitters is that she makes these custom mixes. So she has to wait on um, different aspects of these colors to come in before she can mix them. And I just think that is so neat and unique. Like it's unique to Peachy Olive um, because you're not going to find these exact mixes anywhere else. This is like a graphite gray silver mix. And this shine 
absolutely blows me away. It is so beautiful. It's going to be more opaque than the other colors, so it's not as transparent as opals. A lot of, well, opals are transparent. So this one you're not gonna see through as much when you put onto your cups, but it is still just as beautiful and sparkly and shiny and amazing. And then I'm gonna show you the next color, which is gnarly. So, well, literally. So, Gnarly, if you have Bejeweled by Peachy Olive or Jasmine, this one has kind of that same color scheme to it, that same beautiful blue. With it, I don't know, it's almost like a hint of gold in it. I don't know, you tell me what you think. Um, this one is Gnarly, will not be available until next week. But you get the heads up here, and that way you can decide um, to be on that jump list when she lists it. And a lot of times she'll list these on her Instagram when they are restocked or on her Facebook group. And I'll link those both for you as long as well as along with her website in the description. So thank you so much for hanging out with me, you guys, for watching this video, for making this a beautiful mess with me. Um, I'm never mad at a glitter mess. I mean, it's just too pretty to be mad at. So thanks for hanging out. Be sure to grab one of these beautiful glitters. And also I want to know which one is your favorite, which one caught your eye and why. And I will see you guys soon.